So just about three weeks ago, I checked my BP and it was 182 over 106. Yes, I did get panicky, but then I stepped out of myself and I had a talk with God. And I said to him, Father, but for two things, two things. The first one is your mercy. I thank you for your mercy. Because of that, you will keep me alive and you will keep me whole. The second thing is your purpose for my life, which I know and which I am pursuing. And for this cause, oh God, you will keep me alive and you will keep me whole. And to you, why do you think God has kept you alive in this situation? Why? Aside his mercy? Do you know the purpose of God for your life? And are you... Okay. I'm talking to you, particularly those who have been named after the name of Christ. Do you know the purpose of God for your life? Are you pursuing the purpose of God for your life? Despite the fact that, you know, many of us don't even bother. Many of us don't even care what our assignment is. And I'm talking about them that have been named after the name of Christ. This is a reminder of Mark 16, 15. Jesus says, go into the world and preach the gospel to all nations. That's your assignment. The how is between you and God. God's going to tell you. But that is your assignment. How many people in the space of this pandemic have you shared the Lord with? And while I bring this reminder to you, I encourage you, get a BP monitor at home. Ensure that you feel well. It's your responsibility to feel well. And do keep safe as well. And while you're doing everything, pursue after the knowledge and the purpose of God and ensure that you do it. May the Lord continue to keep you in Jesus' name. Bye-bye now.